Okay, last few things for 1.1. Um, so we'll just say uh, extra loose ends to tie up. Okay, just some terminology mostly. Okay, so I have a matrix one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, 12 minus 14, of course. Now we give this a name, we call this a two by four matrix. Okay, two rows, rows come first, columns come second. Um, what else? Okay, so elementary row operations. Are re hmm? reversible. Okay, so if I do something like um, row one plus two row three, that can be reversed by doing row one minus two row three. Um, if I do like a half row four, I can reverse that by doubling row four. And if you interchange row three, row three and row five, it can be reversed by doing the the uh, well, same thing. Okay, so that's an important property of uh, elementary row operations. Okay, so if we have a matrix. Let's say um, one we had before, one, five, seven. So we had this one before, minus two, minus seven. Just put a line here. Um, minus five. Okay, we, we did a bunch of work, right? And we ended up one, zero, zero, one, negative eight, three. Okay, two things I want to say here. Um, this little squiggle here, I mean, in English we say is row equivalent to, okay, which means that um, if I start at one matrix, I can do some sequence of elementary row operations and arrive at the second matrix. And because elementary row operations are reversible, I can go backwards, right? It's possible to start here, do some sequence of elementary row operations and come back So two matrices are row equivalent. Um, you know, if there exists this sequence of elementary row operations that connect them. Okay, what else do I want to say here? Do, do, do. Line here, line. Uh, solution sets. Um, okay, if you have no solution, 
if, you have, if your system has no solution, then we could say solution set is uh, empty. Two, uh, if you have a unique solution, so like the one I just talked about, minus two, minus seven, minus five, we would say a solution set has one element, okay, unique solution. So you'd say uh, solution set, this is all kind of tedious, I apologize. Solution set is okay, a brace to indicate we have a set. And then just the ordered pair, negative eight, three. This is all in reference to this thing. Now, if I have a system where you have two, two equations which are, which are the same equation, right? So it's simple like that, yeah. Solution set is infinite. Uh, contains all points on with a line x plus y is equal to 1. Okay, solution sets. Just some terminology. Nothing really new there. Okay, so we talked already above here about a matrix being row equivalent to another matrix. Okay, you can also say that the systems are equivalent. Okay, so if I say um, I could say um, x plus five. Mm -hmm. Y is equal to 7 minus 2x minus 7y equals minus 5 is equivalent. Is equivalent to this system. I'm going to put a brace here just to, uh, not there, put the brace here. To the system, well, just the very simple, already solved system. So this system here mm, is equivalent to this system here, uh, meaning that they have the same solution sets. Oh yeah, last thing. Last thing, I promise, for 1.1, is um, uh, when I do operations to say this matrix, to get this guy. Uh, what I'm doing is called called uh, row reducing, row reducing. Row, well, I could say row reduction or row 
producing. Or even just reducing. Okay, you're reducing a matrix. So you're taking a matrix and reducing it to a um, more useful form.